Holidays, of course, are meant to be joyous occasions, but for too many children in our area, it is simply another reminder that life can be a bit unfair and sometimes even cruel. Darwin Singleton shows us the scores of people who are doing everything they can to right this wrong in tonight's Making Spirits Bright. Mullinex Ford's Making Spirits Bright. Today's charity, Child Advocacy Center, is sponsored by Mullinex Ford. By now, all of these toys you're seeing in this van are in the hands of children who will treasure them well beyond the holidays. A far-fetched idea? Not when you learn more about the kids who receive these gifts. Children who wish this Christmas that Santa would simply bring them someone who cares. Andy Wynn is the director of Mobile's Child Advocacy Center, where agencies work together year-round to rescue kids from abuse and put them in a better place physically and mentally. It's even more important now that COVID-19 has forced kids away from school and those who can spot abuse. But about 70% of the reports of, of kids being abused come from their affiliation with the school, whether it's a teacher or coach or, or whoever it is. And so, you know, you just wonder about the kids. The staff and customers at Mullinex Ford wonder about them too. So much so that they collected all of these toys and brought them here. You go through your self-experience when you were a child. You got up that morning, uh, everybody's still asleep and the crack of dawn, we're up. You know, and you get under that tree and that's something under that tree that has your name on it, let you know somebody thought about you and that's for me. Then uh, to bring a little normalcy back in their life or, or maybe even an experience that they haven't had, um, you know, and uh, something that we've all enjoyed as a kid and can remember those memories and, and be able to bring it to them uh, when they've been through some difficult times is definitely important and uh, one of the reasons that we do it for sure. This is more than just getting a toy at Christmas because any of these folks here will tell you long after the toy is gone, the memory of the gift will remain. So I think that that's a way that it carries on and not just, you know, just at Christmas, but then they look at that toy and they remember that from years down the road that there's people that care about them. And we still hear stories about that. Good people like Mullinex Ford reaching out to the least among us to inspire hope and make their spirits bright. Darwin Singleton, NBC 15 News.